Hey everybody, it's Jason. So I'm here with my weekly scent recap number 39 for the week of December 5th through the 11th. So we'll get started with last Wednesday and I had Christmas Cabin. This is a really nice one. It's bayberries, cranberries, orange, and cinnamon mixed together. And Victoria actually has a coffee cup cutie in this scent. It mostly smells like bayberry, but then it does have a little bit of that orange spiciness behind it. So it's a really nice one. Uh, next, Trickster for Kids. This one's supposed to smell like Trick Cereal. A lot of people say it smells kind of similar to Fruit Loops, but it's heavier on like a lemon type of scent instead of like an orange, which I would agree with that. Um, it does smell a lot like the Trick Cereal. And I think it's different enough from Fruit Loops um, that if... Even if you, you do like Fruit Loops, that this one's different enough that it wouldn't be exactly the same to you. So, yeah, I think I like Trickster for Kids just a little bit better than Fruit Loops, too. Christmas Eve was next. This one smells like a really spicy eggnog type of scent. So it's got a lot of different spices in it. A lot of nutmeg, a lot of cinnamon. And then it's got that creamy eggnog scent, so... Yeah, it's really nice. On Saturday, mistletoe. This one is orange and cinnamon. Again. It's just that it's kind of like um kind of like hollyberry. But it's not like a fresh orange, it's more like a dried orange. So. So it's a little bit more of like a almost like a woodsy scent. Okay, next is frankincense and myrrh. This one smells like incense. So if you're into like those kind of incense smells, that would be a good one for you. And then finally, Christmas tree. This one smells like straight up pine. <laughs> and it's really, really strong when you first melt it. But... I think I like sugared spruce better as a Christmas tree type of scent, but if you like pine instead, then Christmas tree is definitely a good one to go with. Last one is Honey Vanilla Love Dust. And this one kind of smells like cocoa butter. It's a nice chocolate scent. But when I melted it, it really wasn't that strong, and it had something else in it that just smelled kind of strange. And it may have been something that the way it was interacting with something that I was cooking. It smelled like corn chips. <laughs> so, I don't know. It, Yeah, it didn't have a super strong throw. And it had that kind of odd smell after it had been melting for a while. So, yeah. So that was my weekly scent recap number 39. As always, if you have any questions, let me know. And I'll see you all soon.